Hey, what's up guys? David here, your Android junkie over at AndroidSpin.com, bringing you another segment of HTC One S-ness. Yes, this is a segment where I feature ROMs and fun stuff for the HTC One S, this pain in the ass phone that is a pain in the ass to the developers, I've heard. But hey, it doesn't matter because they still are dishing out ROMs. And here is an AOKP Android 4.2 ROM that I've been rocking for the last few days, and it's not bad. Not bad at all. Um... I always have like the traditional setup here. As you can see though, I have no status bar and one feature I do like is this. Oh wait. Let's get rid of Stormy there. Boop. There we go. So I have it where my notification bar comes from the bottom up like that and I got my little uh, quick panel setting or my toggles right here. Um, let's go ahead and dive into the settings. Run control. Okay, there we go. General UI. As you can see right here, it's got this, you know, the normal stuff. I didn't do a reboot on this because it has that traditional AOKP boot animation, that beautiful unicorn that's majestic and pretty. Um, but yeah, it's got the same settings as all AOKPs, pretty much. And uh, right here, here's the UI mode. This is something a little different. I have it on tablet where it comes from the bottom and you got phablet and you got phone. The phablet and phone, not too much difference there. I think it's just different when you're in landscape. That's about it. But other than that, when you're in portrait, it's still just a full notification bar that comes down. Um, yeah, nothing else really there. Um, the only thing I do not like about, uh, I'll show you here. Well, I'm not going to get a notification probably right now, but one thing I don't like about it is when you get a notification, it peeks out from the bottom. So if you're typing on your keyboard, boom, you hit that and you go to, oh man, it, there's no way to disable it. On a Paranoid ROM, you can actually disable a pop-up. I mean, I think that's just a 4.1 feature though. Maybe they just haven't added it to this yet, but sometimes that does get kind of annoying. Um, I don't know. Yeah, just me. I'm picky about stuff. Anyways, we got the lock screen, of course, so you can add stuff to your lock screen, widgets, and yeah, you can allow widgets and stuff. Power menu, you know, pretty much the same stuff. Navigation bar, if you want those, uh, or the navigation uh, buttons, if you want those added to it. Of course, there's your battery, if you want to change your battery style. Clock, you can make it center, that's if I had a status bar, and all that fun stuff. Um... Other than that, I mean, you could set up your status bar toggles right here. You know, whichever ones you want to show up right there. So it's a little different. It doesn't have, like, the traditional AOKP toggles that you put in your status bar. Um, other than that, nothing much different. It's a good 4.2 ROM. I don't, I don't mind it at all. Um, I just really like that effect. Um, it's smooth. There is that still that what I was getting with the the baked bean one, the baked bean ROM. I still get that squiggle when I scroll, and I've you know disabled disabled um, the overlays. I've pushed the G GPU render. I've done all that, I've, and uh, still getting it. So I don't know. I don't know if it's just a 4.2 thing on this um, on this phone because I know it's a pain, pain in the ass because it's the HTC One S is just a real big pain. I know that, but it's really smooth. Uh, I'm running Nova Launcher, of course, and jumping into the camera here, um, works fine, takes good pictures, even has burst shot, um, which I have set already, Let's see, so that does work, a um, couple times it's forced closed, the video camera, um, it'll show like it's working, but it will not show what you've recorded, I tried that last night, recorded about five seconds, and uh, didn't get anything in my gallery, so it kind of works so at least the pictures work so that's not too bad yeah you know, you know it is cameras they're just so dreadful Google now actually you know what I'll give it I'll give it this Google now works a lot better on 4.2 it's a lot cleaner it's a lot faster um, even the voice recognition is better I mean of course you know better ver you know better version so it better be better I'm saying better a lot right now isn't that weird Anyways, guys, uh, fellow HTC One S brothers and people who are interested, uh, this has been a look at AOKP Android 4.2 on the One S. Uh, hit that like, thumbs up button if you like this video. Uh, subscribe to the Android Spin channel if you have not already. And I thank you for watching. I am David, your Android junkie at AndroidSpin.com, and this has been HTC One S. Bye bye.